Good morning, ladies. Good morning. Sassy ladies. Look at my, my shirt says sassy. Do we have any sassy ladies here yet? I'll wait just a couple seconds before I get started. I wanted to talk to you this morning about what you're going to spend your, your tax refund on. What do you want to spend your tax refund on? So many people that I've talked to are going to get a new 65-inch TV or um, going to buy a new car. Good morning, Deb. Nice to have you here. This is the first time I've actually had um, a live exact time that I was coming on. Normally, I just come on whenever I feel like it. But um, I thought this morning I would try something new. So I guess I will get started. So do you want to spend money, spend your tax refund money on something that is going to um, help your future out? Or, your, or just your immediate future? Just a question to think about. I want to give you some really smart ideas that you can that you can use for um, for spending your tax refund money on. So the first one I have to say is if you have a lot of debt, it's a good thing to spend your money, spend at least well I would say spend spend all of your tax refund towards your debt if you have a lot of debt. However, I know that's um, kind of hard for a lot of people to even think about spending all of their money on their debt. So um, maybe you could take half of your refund and put it towards your debt and then spend the other half on whatever you want to do for fun. The second thing, if you do not have an emergency fund, this is an easy way, the easiest way to actually get your emergency fund or save your ass account going. I know it doesn't sound exciting, but believe me, whenever something, when you have an emergency, um, having an account that you can just get the money, you can grab the money and not have to use your credit cards, feels good. So um, if you've ever heard of, somebody brought this to my attention, it's Capital One 360. I mean, I've heard of it before, but I guess they have really great accounts, savings accounts that you can set up several. So I know we've talked about different savings accounts that you can have. And the one I'm talking about now is your emergency fund. The third one would be to um, buy something that you need. What's the difference between a want and a need? Because you want to spend it on something that you need. Maybe you need to fix something around your house. So you can spend your money on that. Um, how about um, putting some of your money towards your mortgage? Paying your mortgage down. You know, in America, we spend so much money on interest. It's, it's crazy. So if you can actually put money towards interest, you can be saving yourself a lot, a lot of money. Okay, the, um, the fifth thing is, if you've never heard of a Roth IRA, you need to get a Roth IRA. And you need to ask me or ask, ask a financial professional what a Roth IRA is. Because this is a place where you can grow your money tax sheltered. It actually lets you, you've already paid taxes on it, so all the growth on it is going to be tax free. Okay, I wrote down a couple other things here. Um, you can pay it forward. If you have some um, somebody that's done something good for you, pay it forward. Do something nice for somebody else. Feel so good whenever you're able to help somebody, somebody else. Uh, maybe you want your you have something that you're wanting to get better at. You know you want to be able to offer more to the world. Take a class. Take a college class. Spend your money on something that's going to better you, better your future. Um, let's see, what else did I write down here? Um, how about traveling? You like to travel? Spend some money, some of this money on taking you and your significant other on a vacation. Especially if you haven't been on a vacation. Experiences are so much better than things. At least, at least 
that's how I, I look at it. Um, just my opinion. Um, let's see, if you have children and you want to help them pay for their college and you don't already have a college fund for them, start a college fund for them. And let's see, I know I have more on here. I wrote a whole bunch of things. Oh yes, start if you if you want to um, start a business. This is a, a really great way to spend your tax refund is to um, put it towards starting your own business. Okay, ladies, I'm going to let you go for today. Thanks for tuning in. And if you're watching this on the replay, let me know what you think. And if there is anything specific that you ladies are wanting to know about, please let me know. Have a good day. Peace out.